Hey, what's up, everybody? This is Toasty Gamer Boutique. We're playing Merge Dragons, and it's about time we are going to explore the season, the little chest, and we are going to do some merging here today. Here, we're going to make a five merge with those level one season chests right there. Here, with the level two big season chest, we've got a five merge right there. Oh, yeah, looking fabulous. And here, this is the level four magnificent season chest. Let's check this out here. Very interesting. So those, we just added those to our new merge chain here. Technically, we've got a level four, but we've got to make the merge to actually add it to the discoveries there. So here, that says, discovered the magnificent season chest. Yas queen, it's about time. Let's go ahead, open up these chests. We've got uh, two of the level four. And here, get rid of that apple. Here, you can see this level four chest has a black outline. So that means it's a non-mergeable object. But here, we've got the lower level chest, which have a white outline, which means they're a mergeable object all the way. Whoops, sorry about that apple there. So here, the level one, the level two, the level three, those are all mergeable. The level four is the highest level there. And let's see what's inside. Here, the first level one chest. We've got a level one spotted shroom, a small orb, which I'm just going to delete. Here, we got a blue life flower, not too shabby. There, from the second level one chest, we got another blue life flower, a pink life flower, and, well, another purple orb. So we can just go ahead and sell that there. Let's check out the level two next. Okay, not too bad. Here, we got a level two dragon tree, a uh, sprouting dragon tree there. Love that. Definitely, that's going to come in handy. And that glowing life flower goes over there. Here we got a level three puddle. That should give us a hero mushroom. And here an orb level three. We can sell that for four coins. Let's see what another level two chest gives us here. Interesting. Okay, we got the level two prism flowers there. Prism flower buds. We got another level three orb. And here we got the level four glowing life flower. Now I'm going to go ahead, open up this level three chest here beautiful Ooh, love that there so here we got the level four water this one isn't going to turn into a mushroom the level three and under turn into mushrooms so here we're going to keep that water there awesome and i love most of all we got two glowing life flowers so so far this has been pretty helpful in getting those life flowers here it's that time we're going to open up the level four chest Ooh, and we just got a level five watering hole, a level four prism flower, pretty rare there, looking good. I'm actually gonna bubble that though. Here, I've got my water way over in this corner. So I'll save that there for when I get to working in my water puddles there. Beautiful. That's looking fabulous here. We've run out of space. So when it comes to amber, we're gonna get we're going to get rid of that. Here, this wondrous orb, we can sell that. The little mushroom, I'm going to get rid of that. The puddles, we're just going to get rid of those. This is looking great. Here, the orb, we can get rid of that. I'm going to make it three merge with those dragon tree leaves. Merge those dragon tree saplings. And that's going to give us just a little bit more space. Let's open up this last dragon chest here. Beautiful. But, meh. Not too interesting there. Would rather had some life flowers. Here we've got a couple life orbs and well, I've already healed all the land in my camp. So I'm just going to sell those. So definitely the life flowers were a great take here. Uh, wish I would have got more life flowers, but you never know what you're going to get with those. And speaking of never knowing what you're going to get here, we have four more of the royal rewards. These are bum bum bum. These are the four season decision eggs that I have been saving and I can't wait any longer. A screenshot for the road. Let's go check out what the first one is. Oh, my Lantis. Okay, so this is really hard decision here. Here we've got Sun Dragon, Autumn Dragon, and Skeleton Dragon. These are three dragon eggs that I would each get for sure. On account of the Autumn Dragon being extremely rare wait a second i'm not too sure if i want to do that yet can i unselect that wait a second here we're going to go to the dragon egg menu the other day the autumn dragon egg wasn't in the menu here but i f have a feeling it was just a little bug should be back right i mean there's the thanksgiving merge dragons event next weekend right now we've got the toy event going on but we should be seeing that autumn dragon again okay well 
I can't help myself. I'm gonna go ahead. I'm gonna get one autumn dragon egg. Otherwise, hands down, I'd go for the sun dragon egg. But I think I'm feeling autumn. Putang, that's looking great. Let's go for the second one over here. Ooh, okay. So now we've got autumn dragon egg. We've got the sun dragon egg. And we've got a morpho dragon egg. Another three eggs that I would love to get here. Um, if I'm not mistaken, I already had three of the autumn dragon eggs. So this should make a five merge here. But next one, I'm getting a sun dragon egg. Oh, yes, it is. Y'all, queen, here we go. We're going to go ahead and merge those eggs together. Autumn, yes, here we come. Here we've got a five merge with those autumn dragon eggs. That's going to clear that up. I've had those eggs there for a while. Fabulous. Oh, yeah. And here we've got those. We can move that back real quick, making some more space. Here we have a five merge. This is looking great. But back to the beautiful season decision eggs. Oh, baby. Okay. Here, I was sure I was going to get a sun dragon egg this time. Okay. The morpho dragon egg, meh, it's a great one, but the sun dragon egg is way more rare. So I would have gone sun dragon egg for sure. But here we've got a tier two love dragon egg. So not only is it a tier two, but it's a tier two trophy a tier two trophy dragon egg so i've got to get the love dragon egg right there oh yeah no way and do we have four of those eggs oh do we have a tier two merge that would be too epic passion dragons in the house here we've got a five merge with the love dragon eggs oh yeah gonna go ahead and make a five merge with those tier two there and this is cleaning up my map so well over here this is amazing oh yas queen looking good here we've got those we can move back and I still cannot believe we just got those tier two love dragon. I lost track of them there. But hey, that is amazing. And that's going to help out with dragon power a lot. Here we've got one decision egg left to go. Ooh, okay. So this is a tricky one here. We've got the sun dragon egg. We've got the Zeus dragon egg, and we've got the Nilla dragon egg. Now, Zeus dragon eggs, I can get those easily with my trophy reward items. You know, the Olympus trophy, um, that we could tap. We get the uh, sandals, we can merge those, if I'm not mistaken. We have an easy way to get the Zeus dragon eggs. Sun dragon eggs, Kayla's menu. Nilla dragon eggs, a little bit more rare, but I'm starting to get some trophy items. It's between the Nilla dragon and the Sun dragon. Oof, what to do? D do I think I'm going to go... Do I go Nilla? Or do I go Sun? Nilla or Sun? I know I should probably go for the Sun Dragon Egg, but for some, re some reason, some reason, the Nilla Dragon is calling me. I don't have the Tier 2 of the Nilla Dragon yet, and I really... Really would love to have that discovery. We don't have a merge with those Nilla Dragon eggs there, but that's looking fabulous. These are the trophies I was talking about to get those Zeus Dragon eggs there. So that's super easy. I mean, here we've already got two sandals there. I don't have any more at the moment, but you can merge those. It's easy. Get the Golden Fruit Bowl in there. You can easily get those Zeus Dragon eggs. The Nilla Dragon eggs... I can get those from some trophy rewards, but they're still super rare. I got one the other day, and I'd love to get some more to get that merge there and to hopefully one day discover the tier two of the dessert dragons. That would be amazing. Y'all's queen. Hey, thank you so much for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed it. Make sure to hit that thumbs up button for the like and stay tuned for more tips, tricks, and strategies. And if ever, if ever you're working on the season here... Make sure to check out my website, toastaboutique.com. There's a link in the video description below to the webpage that I made specifically for this event. So there's camp strategies, there's world map level strategies, and there's also event strategies to help you cruise your way through all of the Wild Hearts season rewards, or any season for that matter. Thanks so much for watching. Don't forget to subscribe to Toasted Gamer Boutique as well if you haven't already, and I hope to see you soon. Take care. Peace.